Uh, we had uh, uh, some information happening with Impact, and uh, so so this is unsubstantiated. Uh, the news coming from, I believe, Bill Apter in the Wrestling Observer, if I have all that right. Uh, nope. I, no, it's not Apter. It's, it's um, uh, Meltzer. 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 Oh, okay. Thank you. Good, because yeah. I like Bill. He's a, he's a gentleman and a scholar. And uh, okay, I met him once, and he was really nice to me. Uh, but uh, <laughs> no, but but good, good. I, I I I'm sorry. In my head, I confuse those for some for some reason. Um, mm. I mean, there's there's two old school names of of the the uh, the old school dirt sheets and magazines, right? So They're pretty the, reputable. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And so so that's the they they both kind of interchange in my head for that reason. I I apologies to Bill. I, I don't know, Pastor. So you know, um, and and people apparently, I think people have some very varying opinions of Meltzer as it is as well, if I'm not mistaken. So, but anyways, Mike, you are our resident Impact Watcher, sometimes Impact Death Watcher. We're yes. still figuring out whether there's a death question mark going on here, Mike. What is the situation? What is the information that we've heard, and why is there a question mark by it? Uh, well. Sh- uh, can we just start calling Impact Schrodinger's Ring? Because I'm not sure if they're canceled or if they're not canceled, and I don't feel like opening the box to see. Um, the rumor is that right before Impact announced they were changing their time slot to Wednesdays, uh, Destination America pre-canceled their show. <laughs> um, supposedly when the new TV season starts in September... Impact is not going to be a part of that. Mm-hmm. Um, now, we no one's really heard from Destination America on the topic. TNA has been all over the place saying they're going to sue people and whatnot, and no one really cares about what they're saying because they're, we're not actually saying that TNA is done as a company. They just may not have television. They've done this before. Yes, with Spike TV like, Spike- and... Yeah, they and they're no longer on Spike no. TV. So, and and they've even had like delays of hey, we're gonna move our thing over for a year, or just wait it out for an up- the end of the year. It's all gonna be okay. We're gonna have a new new deal coming out soon. It'll be fine. And they move, but mm-hmm. other than that, they bitch about it. That's the one thing I don't get. Just say the report is wrong and have Destination America say the report is wrong if the report was wrong. Somebody's not telling somebody something. Well, apparently, um, and I would talk about this week's impact, but I would also also just – I, I would just recommend that you go back in the WMS archives and you find what we had to say about Slammiversary 2014 because that's what was on this week for reasons. Uh, but that's uh, sometimes, and I think when we, when we talk about wrestling, we expect, oh, there's a new episode every week. And unfortunately, I think when you look at probably execs from Impact, I think Spike did this sometimes over the holidays where they would do a best of or something like that. Because uh, they're like, well, we're not going to waste new content on this on the holiday weekend. We can't compete with that. We're Destination America. It doesn't matter what we put on. So let's not waste a show that costs us X amount of money to produce on that weekend that we know we're going to get a hit. So okay. I'm and not, I, I'm, I'm, I'm not that, really, so. you know, I, I, I think that's fine. I think that's, I'm, fine. I'm with you on that, but if it's two weeks before you're going to have a time change, mm-hmm. you should probably be airing new content that really plays up that, Hey, we're going to have a time change. Well, I, I, and, and also, change. did you... And apparently there was new Impact content that aired overseas. Really? Yes. That's yes. weird. Over, yeah. Overseas got like new matches and stuff like that. And apparently they got a debut of the Pope D'Angelo De Niro on commentary. They don't have oh. a Memorial Day. Oh. On the same weekend. That's true, too. But still, that... that, Did that, you that say okay. That? That's weird. That, that, it's very confusing. I'm with you. That is confusing. That 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 shows. Ew. I don't know. I don't know what that shows. It shows a complete lack of company organization, because Kurt Angle 
until maybe about a day before Impact aired, didn't even know that they were replaying Slammiversary instead of showing a new Impact. Right. Because he was he was telling people to watch for his I Quit match with Eric Young. And we were like, no. Wow. And that, and that is, I don't think that's a disconnect with Impact in general. I think it's a, it's a disconnect between them and Destination America. Which...